the majority of people to just think we're absolutely nuts. What sane individual wants to slam and smash their face on concrete and bleed and get up and go, okay, cool, and do it again the next day? To me, that's second nature. I would define my work ethic as consistent. I get the job done. So if I give myself a particular task and it's something I've never done, that's tough. But that's how you develop and that's how you grow. And that work ethic came from my upbringing. It came from my father riding a 50cc moped, an hour and a half to work, and then an hour and a half back from work every day come rain or shine. You learn like to feed your family. You can't go to work late. You can't not go to work because then no one gets fed. That really did mold me more than any one thing. First, you gotta find the spot. Generally, I skate stuff at the crack of dawn. I like to try and find stuff a little bit different and unique. If I can see it and I know it's physically possible, then in my head, I've already done it. Where I grew up definitely affected my approach to skateboarding and my need and want to get back up when I fall down. Uh, I don't know any other way to learn a trick than to fall down on my face before I can figure out what I need to do to get the trick. It's been like that since I was a little kid. You know, the city I grew up in didn't allow you to stay back down. If you stay down, you get kicked harder and you keep getting kicked. You learn pretty quick. There is no question of whether you should be getting back up or whether you'll give in. You don't give in. You fight till the end or you've got nothing to live for. I feel like I'm finally skating the way that I always wanted to skate as a little kid, and I'm enjoying that. And that motivates me to get back up when I fall down. Not one day goes by that I don't give thanks that I'm a professional skateboarder and that I got to do what I love to do. And I don't think that'll ever really settle in. Maybe when I'm an old man sitting on the porch smoking a pipe and having a beer, maybe I'll sit back and go, ah, Wow, you did get to live your dreams. You lucky man. Bang, that's when I'll probably die. Right then, one split second after. <laughs> I'm so fortunate and lucky to be able to pursue my dream and get away with it. That's like the great swindle. Thank you.